Oh, the best laid plans of mice and men. So anyway, as I was saying before, I was really cut off by the GoPro doing GoPro things, which is freak the frick out. I also realized that this is the wrong track there. This does not have the toe plate. It is the Kubota under here that has the toe plate built in on the frame. That's going to take a lot longer to get started than finding a solution here. I don't even have a place to hook this up with a pintle style hitch at all. There's nothing here. It looks like it's meant for an accessory, but I ain't got that accessory and I'm not going to the store. I'm not going to buy anything. I ain't got the time for that and I'm not spending no money. I have this already set up for a two inch ball. We're going that route, but that means we're going to have to go full fuzzy fixer, fabrication mode, and fab ourselves up something that we can use with everything we got right here. So it looks like to about here, this bottom of this black bit here is kind of where we have to drop the plate down to. Two 10 inch pieces for our down arms that will bend up into our bottom plate support. Let's give ourselves the plate of about four and a half and it gives us a little bit of wiggle room. Get your gears on, it's gonna be loud. We're going full fab mode. We also have to clean up the scale off of the side that we're going to weld on. We're going to weld on this surface here, so let's clean that up. That looks pretty good. We got our down arms and our beginning of our plate here. It's going to be bent right there, six inches down, out flat, gives about a four inch plate. So now we got to cut at least like three of these guys because these are what? About three quarters of an inch. It's at least an inch shank, so we're going to need. Just got three just to have in the hand. So we need about four inches. Ran dead. Good old Makita. <laughs> <laughs> 